Pound it. Come on. <gasps> You're gonna hang me, leave me hanging? Can you pound it? Thank you. You have to, uh, I don't know if you're aware, but you have to do it with the, the sounds or you're just not doing it right. So today is finally solar day. I just put the brackets on and the deck up the top is framed out. So now we're going to be putting, well, I'm going to be putting um, solar on the roof and then because it's going to rain this afternoon so i want to get that on so i can seal it up before i finish putting on the decking boards Okay, so I have all of my solar all mounted on the roof. It's all wired up. It's coming down through my closet. I'm going to put the male and the female connectors on the end of the solar wires that are coming through the roof. I have to cut them down and then those plug into this. And then I'm going to plug this into the goal zero and hope that it all goes well. I am going to share the link to the YouTube video that I watched on how to do this because he's gonna explain it way better than I ever could, but I'll show you guys me doing it. So I think I bought 15 foot wire and this is how much I had to cut off. Um, Cause my whole living quarters of my bus is 14 feet. So I thought it'd be safe just to go this route. I have way more than I need, um, but I'd rather have more than I need than not enough. What do you think? I got Itabelle here. For moral support. Oh, you got a piece of oh, a piece of grass. Hmm. Pound it. Good girl. That's a very nice little shake. This little badger paw. It's a nice badger paw. Okay. Here's the moment of truth to see if I can figure this out. So I do know the female. I don't even remember what this is called. Goes into the male MC4. So that. I'm putting on to my negative wire. Um, I had I used all these. I used this crimper for my Anderson poles with all of my 12 volt, and it looks like it's the same crimper. So I guess we'll find out, eh? As I'm sitting here doing this, I'm just thinking about the men on the internet that'll tell me I did things like so wrong. Um, and it's funny that it's always the men with like no profile pictures or like a cartoon as a profile picture or like a demon or something. Cause you feel like, I would like assume with like going on the internet, but I would assume it'd be like the females that are bullies, but no, it's the old men that don't have legit profile pictures. Like I'm just going to use pliers and it shall be fine. We'll, we'll see, I guess. I mean, I know it's fine, because I'm about to do it. The guy's video that I'm linking in the description does this so fluidly and so well. So, I suggest you watch him. But, I mean, I think I just did it. Also, she's burrowing. It's my jean jacket. I joke that she's like a dog, but really she's like a cat, she's like a cat dog. Because of all the weird shit she does. Okay, so bottom is going on. Okay. Then this piece is going on with the little things going down. Rune on the top. You have to, uh, I don't know if you're aware, but you have to do it with the, the sounds or you're just not doing it right. Okay. Here's my connector for the power system. 
Male to female. Male to female. I'm gonna go plug in my solar panels and then this goes into my goal zero. So oh, it's time to talk about solar. So it's been quite a few days since I last recorded talking about my solar. And I just gotta put it out there for people. I did everything right, okay? But anyway, so it wasn't working. I could not figure it out. So this is what my setup is. I have three solar panels on the roof, but I'm only using two for this system. They're 190 watts each, so pretty much 400 watts. And I have them connected in series because it's a low enough voltage for my goal zero. That's why I upgraded from my old 1400 to my 1500X goal zero because the 1400 was not, it wouldn't work with my volts coming in from my panels. So it was not working. I tried different wires coming down from the solar panels. I knew the solar panels were, did have energy. Um, so I knew that wasn't the issue. I was on the phone multiple times with goal zero and then they were like i think it's the adapter so you know they're all mc mc4 connectors down to an adapter that puts them into my goal zero by anderson pole or their pop like their power port that they call it now that ended up being the issue i bought one off of amazon and i guess it didn't work um bought another one and it works so my solar is officially working i'm very excited um it was frustrating, so I didn't record any of it because I couldn't figure it out, and I really didn't know what else to do. And so once this worked, I just wanted to like put it out there because I'm sure other people have had this problem too, but I could not find it anywhere on the internet. So you can see my solar panels are here, coming in MC4 connectors, coming around, and then it's to the Anderson pole input, and I'm getting solar. So that was the issue. It's fixed. I'm happy. So these are the two solar panels I'm using to charge my pow my system. Um, this one is gonna be for something else, which I won't get into this video. But this is this is the beauty. I also was just on the roof, um, and I got everything kind of like settled in. It's been hooked up for a couple days, but I like taped everything down with um, my like flex seal tape, which is that stuff's like really amazing. Um, so it's all good to go. I have it all sealed, no leaks. So my solar's done, so that's exciting. It took like a week and a lot of frustration. Like I, I almost just like, I don't know. I was figuring out if this wasn't the fix, I had to figure out another option. So I'm happy. Hello, we're painting today. It's beautiful here today and it's Monday and I don't have work or school, so I have to do it today. Um, I painted the bus obviously last year, but I didn't paint the whole front like cab area. So we're gonna do that today. And also the bumper. Um, I've sanded down the bumper already a couple days ago. So I'm gonna paint that. See, I painted the top, but never painted this area because this is honestly a really good paint job this is the guy i bought it from painted it for me and it's pretty good and i just didn't want to mess it up i just feel like it's a little disconnected between like the white and the tan and i tried connecting it up there but i think it's just time for me to paint let's ask izzy what she thinks we have a serious question here if you think i should paint the front of the bus blink your eyes twice Okay. Also, there's pieces on the ladder that need touched up paint too. And this needs painted, so that's gonna be included. It's a little windy here on the lake today, so I'm getting very wet, if you cannot tell from my hair. Um, the water's like spraying back at me, but I really thought like cleaning this would be like therapeutic, but there's just some spots that like grease has kind of came from, I think the windows and it's not coming off. So it's been like a little difficult, but as I was doing this, it kind of made me like think about and remember um, 
when I was a kid, I used to wash my vehicle like often, or I mean, like my dad did, um, but he had like a whole kit. So it was just something like we did, like, and I'm using that kit today. Um, but as an adult, I just never really washed my car myself because when I was in the Navy, I lived in San Diego for a couple of years and I had like a subscription or like a membership to car washes there. And so I would get my car washed through the car wash all the time. And so this is like the first time in a long time I've really like hand washed my car. And it just like brought back a lot of memories. Yeah, next week. Yep, getting there. too windy to paint the bumpers um casualty of the sunglasses my uh i think they're like 4.99 at a gas station sunglasses i paint all of them so that's not a big deal but good news is my neighbor gave me a beer and told me there's a case for me sitting in the shed like right over there so i guess we're gonna have a beer on this monday afternoon <laughs> this windy monday afternoon this tree keeps blowing its flowers on the bus but i have most of the painting done and i think it looks so much better having them match i'm so glad i did it i just have to do the little things like get up there and paint um right up there but i'm gonna do that once this fully dries because i have to get on the hood to do it but so much better i'm so happy i did it Update. I started getting a little crazy with paint and I painted my door. I got this idea from my friend on Instagram. Um, I'll put her channel right here so you can follow her. But she painted her door and her door I think is like a charcoal or black or something and I liked it so much. So I decided to paint mine green since I have other green elements in the inside of my bus. Whew, well, thank you guys for watching this video. Um, it's been a busy day. I actually just got back from taking my dog to the vet, um, just to do some like checkup stuff before we head out west. It's still extremely windy out, <laughs> but it's really beautiful. It's sunny. So I planned on leaving Monday. Today is Monday. I plan on leaving a week from today to head out west for the next three to four months. Um, but I was waiting for some things in the mail and they came today. So I will probably be leaving sooner. Um, so the next video is probably going to be us on the road. Um, we're just going out west. I don't know where we're going. I just know I want to spend a couple of weeks in Idaho. And I want to spend a couple of weeks in Oregon. In August, I'm going to descend on Bend in Oregon. I'm so excited. So I'll be there at the end of August. So I'm just going to make some stops on the way. If you have any like wrecks on where I should go. Let me know. I want to stay in cooler weather, some kind of thing. I'm going to hang out in like Wyoming, Montana area a little bit. Um, but I'm going to figure out just like a general route probably tonight and then leave. And I'll figure it out on the way. I'm not much of a planner. So next video will probably be a little bit different. We will not be stationary, which I'm really excited about. <laughs>